okay, some students do not understand why the elastic potential energy is not simply the area under this graph. The reason is simply because this is not an fx graph. Your force axis is actually the horizontal axis. See, wait, that's the force axis. So we have swapped the axis. Second reason, this is not an uh, extension. This is the length of the spring. The natural length of the spring is 6 cm. So the extension only begins from 6 cm. So basically, we have swapped the F and the X axis. And secondly, our extension only starts from here. That's why the area under the graph is um, this area here. Maybe it helps if I rotate the graph. So this is your FX graph. And the elastic potential energy is the area under the FX graph. Okay, I hope I've made it clear. Ta-ta!